The Confederation of African Rugby Champions were received with an expected hero's welcome this morning when they returned home from Madagascar. The team was also awarded 500,000 shillings in cash from main sponsors MIGA. The Kenya 15s rugby team, also known as the Kenya Lions, beat Zimbabwe 29-17 yesterday to reclaim the African title that they last won in 2011. Under the new coach Jerome Powater, the 15s team has also reclaimed the Elgon Cup as well as the African title in a month. It was just a start, guys. It was just a start. We are on track where we want to be, where we want uh, um, the World Cup is in sight now. We didn't make promises. We said we're going to take it step by step. We've worked hard for it and it, a, a lot of team effort has gone into this. It feels well deserved to be on top again. With the African title under their belt, the 2015 World Cup is now in sight. However, they have to win against Namibia and face the winner between Madagascar and Zimbabwe next year to book an automatic place to England. Kerry Chamwan Mwangimude says for Kenya to progress, the team has to prepare without interference. And that is why we are talking about uh, our team lobbying with South Africa Rugby Union to allow our team to play Vodacom next year as we prepare. If we play Vodacom in January, February, March, then we'll be set. The team will take a two weeks rest before resuming their training. For JSO at 7, I'm Michelle Katami.